What's going on with you? Hey, how you doing? I'm good. You in Vegas? Yeah, I'm in Vegas right now. Okay. So, so how are you? Pretty good, hanging in there. You know, training, staying ready for whatever. You know. I saw you sparring in Cali. How was that? Oh, it was good. Um, I like to go travel different places to get different work, even if it's like with somebody younger than me, somebody bigger, whatever. With much, it's hard to find somebody with more experience than me these days. But I feel like I'm an old man, and I'm like I'm a vet in the game already. But um, I like to travel places and you know learn things from younger kids and bigger guys with less experience. You know, because I just feel like I can learn something from mm -hmm. everybody. Mm -hmm. And you yeah. was out there with Zab, right? Yeah, I was out there with Zab. Yeah. I know you learn a lot from him, don't you? <laughs> yeah, nah, Zab, Zab been teaching me since I was a little kid. Yeah, 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 that's what's up. So you had your last fight in November. You beat Gamboa easy. So what's next for you? I want the big fights. I've been begging for these fights, begging and begging and begging. And it's like, even guys who's supposed to be my mandatory, like Ryan Garcia, I feel like I'm, call I'm calling for him when he should be calling for me. These guys don't seem like they want a title shot or, you know, that they respect the belt. So it's just like, it is what it is. But that's not going to stop me from calling for them and, you know, begging for the big fights. Mm -hmm. So you think that the fight with T.O. could maybe be made in the near future, like very near future? Of course. I think that um, that fight should be easy to be made. I want to fight. He said he wants to fight. So why not? I think that nowadays it should be up to the fighters. If, I, if a fighter wants to make the fight happen, then two fighters should be able to come together and make a fight happen. Absolutely. Now, Ryan and Campbell fought for the title eliminated. So one of the, isn't he supposed to be a mandatory? Exactly. Ryan? He's supposed to be my mandatory, but I'm making it like – it's just sounding like I'm, I'm, I'm his mandatory the way that I'm calling for him and, and begging for him. Okay, okay. So he's more so concerned with the tank fight. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I understand that the, the tank fight is huge, and I understand that, but at the end of the mm -hmm. day, he my mandatory. So yeah. we should, and we're on the same network. The fight should be easy to be made. Like, it's it's, it's no confusion. It's, it's no nothing. It, mm -hmm. it, it all adds up. Everyone thought that, you know, when who, the winner uh, between him and Campbell was going to fight me, but it's clearly not happening. So... If you can't get T.O., like, who do you think you would want next if you can't get him? That fight can't be made. I don't see why it can't be made, but let's just say it can't be made. All right, let's just say that that, that fight can't be made and the Ryan Garcia and uh, or Tank fight can't be made. Then I'm going to just keep going down the ladder. I fight Javier Fortuna. I fight um, I fight um, Jorge Linares. I will fight mm -hmm. anybody. I will, I'm will. i going to keep going down the ladder. The, the best possible available guy, I'm going to – that's what I'm going to fight. And that's what I've been doing. That's what a lot of people don't understand. They say, oh, you fought again, boy. Oh, you did this. You did that. I fight the guys that that are available to fight me and the best out of those guys. Out of those guys. Mm -hmm. And it's been like this for, for uh, a while. Now, this franchise belt, what's up with the franchise belt? What is that? So I, I didn't even understand when they gave it to Loma. What, what type of belt is that? It's a duck belt. At the end of the day... <laughs> At the end of the day, every weight class don't have this belt. This is not. No, they a, don't. This, is, this is not a real belt. It's not. It's not a real thing. So, uh, how can somebody say that they undisputed when anybody can't win the belt? At the end of the day, say that. Say, say, Cambosos or whatever fought Tiafimo Lopez. No, this is say somebody even worse than Cambosos. Just a random, a random fighter. It just was a a, a tuna fight. Just a, a, a random fighter. Nobody knew him. He just had a good record and. Mm. Uh, Tiafimo decided he wanted to fight him. He was in the top 20 or top 15, whatever the case may be. Tiafimo said, oh, I want to fight him. He cannot win the belt. Yeah. So how – So how you have to petition to go to fight for that belt. So how can you be undisputed? In reality, if you undisputed, it, right, nobody can, mm -hmm. nobody can dispute you being champion. Don't you yeah. agree? If I'm yeah. undisputed, nobody can dispute. I have all the belts. You can, there's no way you can dispute it. Well, mm -hmm. motherfuckers is disputing it, so – <laughs> because you have you have the real WBC belt. Yeah, the the, the real WBC WBC belt. It's, it that's the only belt. Yeah. It's see, I me personally, I think it's too many belts. In my opinion. Yeah, yeah I do. I I, I agree. No. I, I agree that it that it is too many belts, but it's making it real like like I don't know like watery right now. It's it's, it's just too many. So, what you feel about that? I definitely think that it's too many belts, but I mean, it's, it is what it is. It's it is what it is. 
So what about these people still putting Lomo in the top? How yeah, is he? Yeah, how yeah, how, they, how they doing that? Yeah. I, I have the belt that's been around for, for over 40 years. The fight, the mm -hmm. belt that's been around that the, the, the best of the best, the greats have fought for. It. At the mm -hmm. end of the day, if it was, if the option came up for me to become franchise champion, I wouldn't take it. Yeah. Okay. So that basically means you can fight who you want with that franchise champion belt? Is that what that is? Yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, when you franchise champion, you don't have mandatories. Devin yeah. Haney has two mandatories right now. Now, Ryan Garcia, and then my next mandatory is Javier Fortuna. How okay. how am I not the world champion? Or I'm not, um, uh, there's still, I'm not, uh, he's undisputed when I have mandatories. Mm -hmm. if, I, if, if I don't fight these mandatories, then I can be stripped of my belt. You cannot be stri stripped of the franchise belt. You can fight whoever you want, basically. Mm -hmm. And... And then people people talk about oh well um, it's boxing the top guys don't fight each other this and that well that's because we have belts where you don't have any mandatories mm -hmm. you don't have to you don't have to fight you don't you can fight who you want. There's a lot of people on here saying that um, Lomo ducking you. I remember you calling him out before he like when he was like the when they had him at the top dog the pound pound number one and why that fight never took place? What happened? Well, that's when they be, that's when they came up with the duck belt. <laughs> that franchise shit. I was mad. Yeah. They, 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 they <laughs> gave him they gave him the duck the duck belt, which when I was his mandatory, so he's like, Well why would I f duck belt and uh say that I'm undisputed? 